Oh, the Untouchables. Well, yeah. I've read the Untouchables and uh, the Lost Shankly Boy because I know George Scott quite well anyway. And I was at that launch you did in the uh, oh, yeah. same pub in Anfield Road anyway. Um, yeah. In the hotel, wasn't it? In oh, Taggy's Bar. Taggies, that was it. Taggies. Yeah. yeah. I was there that night. It was a well attended night, wasn't it? It was good. And uh, that was a fantastic night. Yeah. yeah, it was brilliant. I brought me books along and got George to sign it and you and and Kieran and as you do, you know, and you you probably don't even remember <laughs> seeing me because there were so many people there. I mean Alan Kennedy was there, as you know, and that's uh, right, yeah. George Sefton dropped by, uh, a few others as well. It was Yeah, uh, Mark Platt yeah. was there from LFC TV, wasn't he? And uh Yeah. Uh, Karen Gill, Shankly's granddaughter, was there. That's yeah, no, right. that was a, right. it was a brilliant yeah. night. Yeah, it was a good night. Yeah, so they've been a they're pretty successful. I mean, George keeps sharing it on Facebook. It's in the top ten of this, or it's on a bookshelf here with all these books. So they've been pretty good, haven't they? Those pair of books, yeah, yeah. And and in many ways, you know, um, George's book was a joy, um, and because actually it's just an incredible story. Um, it's almost I've I've spoken to many people about this and said you know it's almost like a a, a classic hero's tale. You know you think of Luke Luke and Luke and Obi Wan in Star Wars and <laughs> Frodo and Gandalf in Lord of the Rings and you know it's it's that kind of young boy faced with tragedy early in his life going on a journey from you know this small town in Aberdeen to Liverpool where he meets this charismatic, mesmeric figure like Shankly, who completely, it's fair to say, changes his life, even though yeah. he never broke in to the Liverpool first team. It's fair to say that Shankly has guided George's life ever since, you know, and, um, you know, that, that well, as soon as I sat, I went to meet George to, um, with the view to doing an interview, to just, just producing an article for, for this is Anfield, and I spent like 20 minutes talking to him and thought there's more than an article here. 